This one's gonna be heavy, guys. Trigger warning, pedophilia. Wow. So, people really got upset at me when I pointed out that one of the races in Blade and Soul are intended to be a Lolita fantasy in my recent horse mistress video. Most people were too busy paying attention to the actual content of the video, which was about being silly with the character creation, which by the way is a lot of fun, so I highly recommend it. But my shocked reaction to the clearly prepubescent yet sexualized race is what ended up getting the most comments. Truth be told, I shouldn't have been shocked to see this race here, but that I know about this trope in anime and similarly themed culture doesn't make it more acceptable or something I'm willing to overlook. People who have asked me about the things I disliked about Japan will all know my biggest problem with the place, the normalization of animated child pornography. I'm going to talk about Japan a lot in this video, since I lived there for four years and that's where I have my knowledge in this topic, but given that this game was made with Korean animators, I can only assume it's normal there too. I'd assumed Korea was a bit more, for lack of a better word, western, with what it views as sexual, as the ladies in popular media that I've seen from Korea tend to be a little bit more mature looking, not like your AKB48s and similar content from Japan. I mean. I haven't seen anything like Kodomo no Jikan come out of Korea, but I guess this game lets me know that just because some of the media is less skeevy, there really is a bit of that Lolita mindset sitting not far from the surface. I'm not going to waste too much time talking about how our culture has massive problems too, because it does, but that's not what this video is about. I'm also not going to debate the morals behind this form of pornography. I can't have that discussion, but feel free to do it in the comments section. I am not going to engage with you about it though. Lots of the people who play this race, and the overwhelming majority of people who were offended at my observation, are women. But that doesn't shock me. A few of them claimed they couldn't possibly be pedophiles because they're female, which you're wrong there, but I wasn't calling you pedophiles. In fact, I'd guess that the majority of people who play these characters do so because they're cute. It wouldn't shock me at all if there wasn't some of that maternal Mwah thing when people see their baby faces. Not just that, but many other cultures, including the one I was raised in, idolize innocence and immaturity a lot as well. We haven't yet normalized pornography of prepubescent girls sitting on the shelves at our local bookstore but we do have the virgin culture and the schoolgirl fetish thing, and the reason so many sexy races are chosen in MMOs is because we, as a species, like having that escapism of being something incredibly desirable for a while. Sadly, this means, in this instance, that what you're seeing as desirable is, in fact, a child. Do you personally want to sleep with it? No, probably not. Is it weird that you're responding angrily to my messages? No, not at all. You were caught off guard by my words and you're so upset that you didn't see it yourself. Now you feel like you've done something horrible, but to be honest, you haven't. You probably weren't ever doing anything but playing the damn video game. It genuinely probably never crossed your mind. To that I say, good for you. You are from a place in the world where you've never had to deal with this sort of thing. You've never thought of characters this way because you've never been confronted with it. I desperately wish I could be you. Then we have people who get super angry at me. When I read their comments, all I can see is someone who is well aware of what the character looks like, and how they are likely treated by some, and are trying to suppress their knowledge. They are upset by it, possibly as much as I am. They are just pushing it to the backs of their mind and going la la la, so when I say, hey, this is creepy, their only reaction is to be mad, because I said the thing that ruins the race and the game for them. <sighs> Now, something else that has come up is that the Lin is not the first nor the most popular race like this in gaming. For example, people angrily told me that the La La Fell from Final Fantasy and the Ellen from Terra are far worse. And you know what? You're pretty correct there. I wouldn't say either of those races are worse, but they're about the same. Yeah, we've reached a place now where this is normal. It's not your first rodeo with a race like this, but it is mine. I didn't know about these races. Frankly, I wish I still didn't know about them, but ignorance is bliss and all that. What I have to say about these other races is simply that just because someone else murders someone doesn't mean you get to do it too. People are probably going to assume that I hate Japan after watching this video. I don't. I loved living in Japan. It's a super beautiful country with a lot of very awesome people in it and a super cool culture and just awesome food and it was a wonderful place and I truly adore it. But this particular aspect of mainstream culture there isn't one I can personally shrug off as harmless, because it's not. And to the hordes of people who will shout at me, they are nymphs, not humans, I say, there's another work of fiction that uses the term nymph to describe sexual underage girls. It's called Lolita, and the main character is a pedophile. 
please hit that thumbs up, or more likely thumbs down for this video, as either one helps my channel. And I don't normally request this, but if you agree with me and my views on this, please, please leave a comment down in the comment section. I know this is going to bring out a lot of anger in people, and it would matter so much to me if I heard from both sides of this argument, rather than just the hateful one. This is a tough topic for me, so it matters that I not feel alone in a world of hate and anger and ignorance. From the bottom of my little black heart, sorry for putting you through that. Goodbye.